Hey everybody, it is Miss Place Uber Girl. What's up? How are you doing? So we are Uber's Troopers update, quick update. Um, we are on um, the upswing, obviously, of round two. Wednesday is going to be round three. So we are getting there. Slowly but surely. 12 rounds total as of right now. So unless the doctor changed anything. Um so other than that, I'm doing very well. Um, haven't lost any more weight. Um, and actually, this round was a little bit easier. Um, those first five days are wretched, but it was a little bit easier. So that's my Uber Troopers update. Everybody, love you guys. Thank you for everything. We are but all the way you know, across this nation. Um, so anyway, I have something really cool. I've not gotten to do this yet and I was really excited. Now I have tried my hand a little bit at gold panning um, and it was um, when I was back in Michigan so this was Lake Superior Flower Gold um, or as some people call it Nano Gold. It is so small and so hard to do by hand that um, pardon my puppy, um, I mean for a beginner who doesn't really know how to pan okay, it's not very easy at all. Um, so, you know, I tried and, and I gave it a really good effort, but obviously I'm not in Michigan anymore. I am back in Texas. So I got some feeders and I got crushed the cars with feeders. Um, and I'm going to insert videos here. I've done bag one and two. So he has three different style bags, a beginner's bag, an intermediate, and then an expert. I've not done the expert yet. Um, I know it's going to have a lot of black sands in it. Now I did the intermediate and I have a lot of black sands. And so I did pretty well, I think. Um, I got my quarter gram worth out of the beginner's bag, so that was cool. And I'll insert a picture and everything of it weighed out. Um, there was seven pickers total, and that weighed out to exactly a quarter of a gram. Um, the intermediate, I don't know exactly how much it is because there's a bunch of black dirt, and I have a lot. A lot of gold in that black dirt. I have a lot of flake gold. There's some nano gold in there too, and I'm not that good at it yet. So the pickers, I am gonna weigh, and I'll show you guys how much the pickers weigh. There was one, two, three, four. There's like five, six pickers, five or six, um, and they weigh about a quarter of a gram. Um, but the there's a lot of this flake gold, and I don't know how to get it all out. It's practice. I mean, it's really what this is. So super cool I'm excited regardless like I got gold I saw a lot of flashes in my pan and I was so so excited about that so um, let's get into it all right guys we are going to give this a go I'm so excited um, so I've already opened this one and we are getting some water a five gallon pail um, obviously I have three different size these pans actually came from um, Ed from Flash in Your Pan. So Flash, thank you, Mr. Ed. Always much appreciated. I have used these before, um, trying with Lake Superior Flower Gold. That is very, very, very hard to do. Um, and I do have the Expert, which is supposed to be pretty hard to do. Um, so I also have, boom, it's not dead dry. It is the rinse aid, but it will help. Um, but we're gonna start with Gold Beginners. And the first thing we see, I don't know if you guys can see in there, probably not. There's a penny and a Clash guitar pen. So, you're going to just start this with the penny. There's some crystals in here. There's a doggy and a kitty trying to get in. <laughs> this is Miss Snow's birthday. She's one year old today. Happy birthday. Um, I'm really actually quite interested in these crystals. I know there's a guitar pick in here. Come on, there it is. I can just see it. It's just hanging there. Come on, guitar pick. Yay! I don't know if I'm more excited over the guitar pick or the gold. <laughs> so there we have it. All right, I'm gonna get this in here and I'm gonna actually look at these. Um, that almost looks like aquamarine. And then definitely is amethyst for sure we'll see 
whatever you need. Thank you. Okay, so just really quick. I don't even have the whole bag emptied out. And look right there. Is that what I think it is? It certainly looks like it. A mini pickup. Boom. Okay, we are on the beginner's pay dirt and just having to set up a some kind of setup so I can do this outside. So I got part of the bag in this smaller pan and I was just doing up the little bit that was in the big pan and just off the bat. Look at that. There's three pickers. We are on pan number two of the beginner's pay dirt and boom. I see one, two, three, four little pieces. This is so cool. All right, so at the end of the beginner's pay dirt bag, here we go. We got seven nice little pieces. A 2013 penny that has no numismatic value, worth one cent. My Clutch guitar pick, two pieces of amethyst. I believe this is aquamarine, maybe Clutch can fill me in one way or another and it looks like some cords or calcite um, so all in all really good bag I am very very pleased so we will move on to the intermediate next <laughs>
I do have things separated out. Um, and then, of course, I got my bottle there that I'm sniffing up all the all the little bitties. Um, and, yeah, we'll go from there. So, this is probably all I'm going to do today. I will work on that one. Uh, maybe tomorrow. We'll see. I might feel good enough to do that one today, too. That one's going to take a little bit, though. Okay, so out of my beginner's pan, as I showed you guys, this is some of the goodies that I received out of that bag. He does put little extra goodies in there, which is, you know, fun to find. Um, we also, so now I have two Clash guitar picks. I was more excited about the Clash guitar pick, I think, than the gold at first. <laughs> like, woohoo! Um, I also, this one, so I got a penny here, but that's 2013. Then um, as a coin collector, you know, I'm like... But this one, I got a weighty. We got a weighty. It's a 56D. Um, so that was cool. It's like, sweet, fun weighty. And then as I was doing the second half of the bag, boom, we got us a bullet. I think it's a 45. Obviously, it's been fired. Uh, so that was actually kind of funny. We were laughing. I was like, no way, there's a bullet in there. Um, but these are the pickers that I got out of the intermediate bag. So right here, we are zeroed out. And we are going to throw all these on here and weigh out our pickers from our intermediate bag of pay dirt just to see what we got. So we are at 0 0.22, almost a quarter gram out of pickers. Now, this is the pan with all of the flake gold. I mean, even up here, there's, a, there's one there. There's so much... Um, like gold in here like this i mean you just it's all over and yeah so i mean there's a piece hanging out here there's just stuff everywhere and so i'm not really good at getting this stuff out now yes i could i could sit here and put some water in there and a little bit of uh, dish soap or jet dry and and get these bigger pieces out that would be fine um, this is the stuff that I'm having a hard time with. So it's just going to take practice. That's all it is. Um, so those are the first two bags. I'm going to assume that this is probably about a quarter of a gram. Um, the intermediate bag, which is this one is a half gram guaranteed. So, um, I have absolutely no complaints. I think it is definitely fun. It is worth it if you want to learn how to do this. Um, you get some extra goodies in here that you might find. You just never know what you might get. Clash, if you watch this, please tell me if this is aqua. I think this is aqua. It has a bluish tint. I know that's probably not the best thing. I'm sitting on my bed. But, um, yeah, I think that's a little chunk of aquamarine. Which, if it is, is absolutely badass because that's my freaking birthstone. So, you know, kick ass. And then, you know, some amethyst, and I think that's just some calcite or quartz. But, you know, it's freaking fun. So, definitely worth it. Um, thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you on the next one.